Hello, hello, everybody. We are continuing our adventures here in the wonderful adventurous world. Did we ever learn the name of this world? I don't think so. It's just the Forgotten Lands. Hmm. But yes, we're continuing on with Kirby in the Forgotten Lands. Chloraline asked for our aid after we defeated everything and everyone and saved the day and defeated what we thought was the final boss, but apparently there is more game to be had. Sorry we disappeared on you, Chloraline. The space through the tiny vortex is so weird. It's made from powerful psychic energy. I think I've been in that place before. It felt just like being absorbed by my other half. Leongar must be stuck in that mysterious space somewhere. We'll keep looking for him in there, okay? Just hold on a little bit longer. And that's exactly where we're going. We're gonna head through that space and vortex space time and see what the magical isolated isles, forego dreams, have for us. This very dull, this really reminds me of uh, the diddly dee, the final bits of Star Allies, but let's see. So we're not, we're no longer saving Waddle Dees, we're collecting suns. So, I hope this isn't just a uh, best of things. But let's see. I'm already digging the music. You got a piece of Le Leon's soul. Wait, is this Leon Gar's soul? It must be a tiny fragment of it. If you collect more of these scattered soul pieces, you might be able to save him. Try to collect more pieces of Leon's soul as you explore the isolated isles of Forgo Dreams. I would have powered on last time and done much more of this if I knew that there was going to be so many pieces of Leon's soul. This is not going to be the final stream. I can already practically guarantee that. Unless they're handed out like candy. Because it is going to take a friggin' lot of uh, finding Leon's souls. Unless it, you don't need to 100% it, but I don't know. There has to be something for getting all of them, surely. Fuck, it wants hammer. How dare you. I miss the old Kirby days in which you could walk backwards and enemies would respawn. Well, luckily, they provide a ton of hammer dudes up here that I can steal away and head back and do the hammering. And there goes my sword. Get in it. Die, you spike boy. I love how they go become 2D. So yeah, so far, this just seems to be a repeat of the first uh, level in the game, which honestly, I don't mind too much because I don't think we were able to replay the first level. The introductory tutorial-ish level was kind of, uh, cordoned off. Well, it's not a level level. It happened before everything. How dare you. I mean, sure, I took my eyes off the screen, but still, how dare you. But this does mean that the Leon Souls could be friggin' anywhere. Unless we get, like, 25 of them at the end of a level. And it also depends on how many levels there are in this. I don't trust you. I knew I was right to not trust you. You hid it behind you, you bastard. Uh, at least they give me uh, clumps of them sometimes. 
So yeah, the big question is, how many do I need? How easy are they going to be collectively? Okay, a Shadow Bastard. Now I just want to play Persona. Maybe after this. Maybe after I beat this. This game. It all depends. What? Okay. Getting sneaky. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I will play Persona 4 Golden and actually stick it through this time. After I put, beat this game with all the shadow dudes. Hello, Skullis. Sorry. Yeah, brain. Uh, I'll just say Skull. It's easy on my mind. How are you this evening? We are going into the magical world of Kirby Post game because usually when we get to the Eldritch Abomination at the end of time, usually that means that that is the end of things. Game decided no. There was going to be more. There is a whole post world where we're collecting the fragments of a guy's soul. I don't think I've seen that move before, either because I killed him too fast before. Or this new world has lots of magical things to hurt me with. And then I just shattered him to a billion pieces. I guess I'll take you. Might as well. Looks like you've already collected all the pieces of Leon's soul in this spot. Let's check the next area. Okay, that's nice. The boy is coming through with us. <laughs> for us. Never mind. I'm taking my... I'm getting sword. Sword for life. Meta Knight life. Especially because it's my most powerful ability. Literally. Fight me ghosts. I'm a ghost buster. Ah, new color palette. Nice. It was either that or it just looks weird with the filter that's going on. On the world. Kirby seems exempt from it. Ah, I should have known. This is not a platform for you. Be gone. Call me Dr. Eggman, because I, I do not begrudge no hedgehogs upon my land. Oh, I, I keep forgetting. That, that is such a basic thing. I do not need to get rid of ability to grab this. What is wrong with brain? Gee, Bray, what are we going to do today? The same thing we do every day, Pinky. Fail miserably. Yes, I really need to decide what to play after I annihilate all of everything. Beat the Eldritch Abomination of today. What is the Eldritch Abomination of tomorrow? I need to make decisions, make schedules, but I'm terrible at keeping schedules. I don't know why, this feels important. Or just blocks. Blocks do. Open sesame! I have cans to destroy your soul! Which is hilarious, because we're here to collect pieces of soul to, to save somebody. Also, hor horrifying implications of uh, the big bad of this game, if being absorbed by them literally tears apart your soul. Nightmare, nightmare. Oh boy! A gotcha capsule! Which really works for me, because some of the best figures in this game come from that capsule type. Huzzah! Oh, I think I get what this section is going for. Finally, it's clicked inside my head. I believe that this section is kind of a best hits for each world. That is, you are a horrible, horrible, horrible bomb. That one. You fool. Le fou. We're Beauty and the Beast up here. Go, Bob. 
I shall throw you. I think that's the first time that I actively threw a bomb or anything. Normally, I just spammed them and not actually used the aiming reticle. Who needs aim? I have bomb. Nice to see that that revealed a soul. Also doesn't help, because now I'm going to have to remember every single secret passage in all the level sections that we've come to. And hope that, okay, at least this one is just a maximum tomato and not an actual piece of Leon's soul. Which would have been very, very harsh. Aha, you forgot one of the early secrets of the game. You shall suffer and bleed. How dare you. Ah, the explosions really do look like... Bomberman explosions. I was only joking before about taking over his job. Damn you. Double damn you. Okay, aim. Why'd you pirouette like that? Damn you. Oh, never mind. I could actually hit it without aiming. How dare you, game? You put in expectations that I must aim, and then I did not need to. Pain and misery. Now, ah, that's actually super handy. Hope I don't need sword. That would be very mean, game. Do we run from anything new or just giant boulder? Still the giant boulder. How dare you. Double how dare you. I shall steal your soul as recompense. Ah, at least I still got that. Yay! I was slow on the uptake, but I still got it. Quite honestly, having the soul would have been... Really? 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 You're putting a soul down here? Why? At least that was the last one of the area. But still, that was potentially easy to miss. Yeesh. And for some reason, I keep forgetting <laughs> that the Elfin Bro, Elfalin, will actually come through and say, hey, you did all the things for this area. For whatever reason. Probably should have taken his power. Oh, I have to go backwards it's because there might be a soul back here. It's Dark Souls. I must grab all the souls. Even if it's a boss soul that I'll never even turn into an ability. I must grab them all. It's like Pokemon. Dark Souls Pokemon. Both ways. In the Pokemon RPG style and the uh, Dark Souls third-person action the RPG style. Brain tripping on words. Alright. We'll, we'll need something. That was the something. Oh, the Jesus. That went really fast. If I was even a slightly bit smaller, uh, smaller, slower, I would have completely failed to pick up on that. Hello, and welcome to hard mode. Everything's here to kill you. Primarily, the missing out on <laughs> the collectibles of the era. Okay, good. We didn't need to run into him. I shall take you, because you are powerful, and power begets awesomeness. I, I phased through a, a box, apparently. And now we gotta run, because I think this guy is gonna go boom. Oh, never mind. Unlike the Waddledees, he did not try to fly off into the ether. Okay, good. That's all for this area. I wonder if this is gonna set up to allowing me to... Uh, let me re unjumble my words. I wonder if this is leading up to allowing me to select 
whichever section of the level I want so I can more effectively hunt the Leon Soul. So I don't just have to go dibbity d through the entire level five billion times, screaming, Where is the Leon Soul? Kind of like all the <laughs> Waddle Dees, like, I have to get through this level to do this one section again and again. Misery and woe. That would be nice if I could select each. Okay, that is mean. And now I'm dead. You bastard. I can't attack you there. Eh, I gotta play hopscotch. Okay, I'm gonna leave the cone here, just in case. We'll probably need to come back for it. Yep, I just wanted to be super sure. I would rather not risk my beloved cone to the depths of hell. Die, cursed soul of abomination, damnation. One of these is probably going to hold a soul. That would be mean, but I could see it. Aha. Uh -huh. You are... We expect you to attack suicidally. Or come back, and it's... Harsh, but fair. But he is a... Oh. Ah! Okay, that was actually really cool, coolly timed. Terrifying, but kind of awesome. Wait, I really need to decide. What is it that I shall play? Okay, that's just here. I did not expect treasure stones to just be in the middle of levels now. I know it's an unconventional level, but still. Wait, I need to decide. A proper... Uh, that's what I probably should do, is like, this is what I plan to play after I play this. So that I can actually, like, have things in brain. Damn you. Scarfy. Scarf my soul no more. Oh. Bye-bye, Cone. Wait. There's... Soul. I know there is, because I haven't gotten it. Unless techni unless taking that like leads to a like already a, a new place, but still within this section. I feel like I've missed one in this area. Why is there a shadow? Oh, it's the the boxes. It's the boxes shadow. I'm gonna go through and destroy all these on the offhand chance that they hold secrets beneath them. Because I don't need the cone anymore, from what I can see. From what I can assume. Jeffrey! You devious bastards. Okay, good. Okay, good. <laughs> the hidden one. Oh, I'm dead. Bye-bye, Kirby. Pain and misery. I don't even know how they... Oh, and maybe they expect you to jump down and then begin floating once you grab it. But I am too cautious for that, and therefore I died. That's kind of ironic. Your caution has led to your demise. Haha. -ha. I wonder if that would be called paranoia. But at least thank you, Elphalyn, for telling me where things do lie in finality. I'm going to keep my fire. Are we going to... Can I just jump down? No, we have to take the star. So we're going to fight Mega! Goro Majima. Strong Arm Delusion, Phantom Goremondo. I'm coming for you, Billy. Oh. 
He's angry. Dang it. Okay, you have a lot of... Oh, mid-air shockwaves. You... Thank God I got all the Waldies and don't have to no-hit you. They bounce twice. Is this how Leongar saw his... Uh, his champions before? Oh god, these are gonna be in the ultimate arena. Fear. Like, maximum fear. If I can just catch you on fire. And then you're gonna super spin to win after me. Yeah, that's pretty super. No, no. Burn, baby! Oh, I thought that was gonna do a shack wave, but it did not shack wave. Overall, not terrible, but still. Pretty harsh. The ultimate arena is gonna break my soul. We got a guy's soul. Please say that's all of them. I do believe Elphalyn said all of them, yes. All of them, yes! So we should be able to full clear each one. All right. The Ranger's Great Discovery. The new world is filled with danger and temptation. Any unexpected detour during your adventure could lead to a mountain of treasure. How many other surprises are hiding out there? There's only one way to find out. Horror and pain and, uh, scare. The biggest scare in world. Alright, that seems to take up, like, an eighth of his soul, I would say. If you need to rush back to town, you can just press B. Thank you for reminding me, but I already knew that. Leon Soul, Forgo Bay. Yeah, this one only has 48 in there. Let us see, let us see. Wants me to be a snow person, so fine. Gotta be careful. So I don't want to miss anything. Fish, why? Stupid fish. Oh. I need to restart this level. Because it destroyed that. It put a diddly damn vortex underneath the soul. How dare. Devious fiends. Just like that. Devious bastard. Destroy the fish, destroy all foes. Get more soul. And be very, very careful. Because now they are introdu <laughs> introducing ways to destroy pieces of the damn soul. And we don't want that. Yeah, that's actually kind of interesting. By freezing him, his body stayed while the darkness remained. <laughs> so it's just like, I don't know why, that's just kind of interesting to me. And from the looks of things, I will be needing the ultimate version of... I probably need you, don't I? I can only assume random cutter is here because they want me to cut. This looks ominous.
Now I'm just gonna be paranoid that the world ow, bastard. That the world wants me to, one way or another, have the abilities I'm scared. Oh! Uh, you are kind of new! Oh, you! Yeah. Yep, they are getting new abilities. They are getting new abilities and powers for the mini bosses. Alright, that was just uh, for money. I don't need need all that much money, but still, it's nice to have. Almost got scared there. It's like, did I fall into the back rooms? Hmm, they're loading up a bunch of gun guys now. Which makes me feel like I should have a gun. At the same time, why not sleep? So I can get super health. It's portable healing! And I get a bonus health bar to boot. Die, seal boy. That actually hit that. Ah, flee, seagull. I doubt I'll have to greet you all, but still. Soul is mine. Kirby becoming uh, what's his name? Shang Tsung from Mortal Kombat. Your soul is mine. But instead, it's just Oyo. Fear the almighty monster. Poyo, Poyo Mancer. Who needs necromancers when you have the almighty Poyo Mancer? Fear. Fear, though, how much trickery there may be. Seriously, I'm, my brain is just like, please, please be kind, game. <laughs> Do not have horrible secrets out to destroy me. That I think that counts as a horrible secret, out to destroy me. Thank you very much. Troll thyself, bastard. Fine, I'll just shoot that one. Oh, it's just a star shard. Well, not star shard, but it looks like a star. It should be called star something, but no, it's just a treasure rock. Why aim for there when we can aim for there? Aim to be square. It's quite hip. American Psycho. So, yeah, it, it's kind of funny how some of the... The soul shards are, like, super easy, and then other ones are, like, cruel. Actively cruel. At the very least, it seems it's taking segments that I can actively backtrack with. So... Thank you, game, for not being a total bastard. So I can actively look around for missing pieces of the soul and not be like, ah, damn, I have to play the level over again. Except for that barrel bit over the vortex at the start of this level. And I'm loving the music that's playing. It was quite wonderful. For a moment there, I was like, I hope it's not because I put music on at the uh, Waddle D play music auditorium. But no, this is different music. Arr. Give me all your soul. Your soul belongs to me. To me. 
Great, now my brain has been reminded, hey, near uh, near Automata exists. Automata? I don't know. You should really get back to playing that, because I think I did two streams of it years, well, years, maybe, <laughs> a long time ago, and it is still on my I need to get to list. One of these days, I will actually get around to playing all the games that I mean to play. Bastard. We're gonna put a double bastard. I'm trying to get my hat back. We're gonna make a rock fall right in front of where the treasure is. They'll never see it coming. And they're doing it again. Cruel. The cruelty never ends. At least that's all the souls. Nice. So far, they have not been mean. Which I really, really respect. Because they could just go major dick. With the, this, these levels. But no, these are actually fairly a breeze. To which I say thank you, developers. Thank you, HAL Laboratories. Excuse me. Bastard, give me my hat back. My hat. My hat! My hat is where it's at, and if I don't have my hat, what am I but a fraud? Also nice that the souls seem to have, like, some level of, uh, magnetism to them, so... If you do appear to lose it a bit, you do still have some opportunity to get it. Which is very nice. I think I misspoke, because I'm doing things while speaking, and that is horrible. It's horrifying. Give me that soul. Yeah, they have magnetism to them, so you don't have to be super precise with them. Because some collectathon 3D games with, like, oh, you have to pick up these things in the world can sometimes be a bit cruel. It's like playing, uh. It's like playing, uh, Spiral the Dragon while Sparks is dead. Uh, you take enough damage, Sparks isn't there, so he's not auto collecting all of your, uh, <laughs> gemstones for you. God, that would be all. That would be an interesting mod for, like, a Spyro game. It was like, play through the Spyro game, but without sparks to gather your gems for you. And just look at this water. I've never noticed. I've never consciously noted the water looks pretty damn good in this game. My brain it is just firing on everything. Look at this. Look at that. Just in case, because I am paranoid, I would rather not to just <laughs> not have the ability. I doubt that they would do it. I doubt that they would do it. They'd give you an opportunity to see what ability you need and then go, haha. Uh, you must backtrack a bit, but you can still do it. Die. Coin. Death. Bum. So This is like one of those runner games that you get on your phone. Crash Bandicoot Run. Meet Kirby Bash. Hmm. Well, obviously I need to get that somehow. What the hell? Oh. This is interesting. I didn't expect this. If you become stairs, you can defy wind. Not what I expected. Begin, O oh mouth. I am not going to say what just came to my head. No. I refuse. I have some decency. And that decency is being played today. Praise me with thanks, dear viewers. 
for not subjecting you to the horrors of my mind. Even though that's kind of what people watch streamers for. Oh dear streamer, subject us to the depths of your horror, but not your depravity, because then you'll get cancelled. Ah, Kirby cannot... <laughs> that is beyond Kirby's ability. He cannot <laughs> swim while he has a giant ring in his mouth. That would be a very weird thing to see or, or animate. Wait. What? There's a hidden soul in here somewhere. There has to be. So they don't think I missed any in the actual speedrun segment. Ah! Sneaky little bastard. Huzzah! My record remains. I have not missed a single soul except for that one that was taken by a vortex, and, but that doesn't really count now, does it? I should have seen the Vortex, but at the same time, Leon Gar should have seen that Vortex, too. It's his soul. I'm gonna keep the... I'm gonna keep the sword. Time for Unfriendly Woods. Super Mode. Illusionary Fronds, Phantom Tropic Woods. Oh. Well, that's just not nice at all. Bastard. He's gonna machine gun me with his breath! Okay, for a moment there, I thought he was actually going to lock onto me and start uh, sending breath attacks at multiple levels. Like, he'd be like, ah, you dodge? How dare. His giant bomb of a coconut disappeared. Because I hit... Oh. What? I have to do a maze! The... The shader is weird. Okay, he has a lot more roots. Again, thank you, developers, for not having me to do no hit runs of some of these things, especially because each level ends in a boss fight now. And please say to God that that's all the souls that I require. Well, soul pieces. It'd be very weird if one person had more souls than others. But I think that's, like, the basis of a lot of stories. My soul is worth five souls. I'm a five dollar bill person. In the going rate of souls. You could call it Soul Caliber. Forgo Park. So yeah, it doesn't seem horribly terrible. If all if the souls are continuously wait, the boy was gonna say, I'm not scared, because I've got you right by my side, Kirby, right? Right. It is nice to have a friend that believes in you. But at the same time, it'd also be nice to be Kirby. And just have nothing to worry about because you're basically a physical eldritch god. Now that makes me wonder if there's an isekai fan fiction of people becoming Kirby. There has to be, right? But at the same time, it's like not really the thing that comes to mind. <laughs> at the same time, I don't really think that. Kirby fan fiction is all that. Oh, I forgot. There's a goop. I did not see the goop. Because shader. And also, I'm blind. Be yeah, like, surely. On the one hand, surely there's got to be Kirby fan fiction like that. But at the same time, 
it's Kirby fan fiction, so it's just like, oh, I thought that was going to be a ledge and I was going to die. But I didn't, so huzzah. Ah, whatever needs to be done with Cutter can be done with Sword, surely. We will kill all the hedgehogs, because I... Now I'm reminded that I also want to play more Sonic games again. Even that horrible abomination uh, of a DS game. I forget what it's called. I think it was made by Bioware. I think. And, it, like, it is a masterpiece of horror from what I understand. So it'd be interesting to experience... It's the same kind of fascination that drives me to want to play Kingdom Hearts 358 over two days. Why would I subject myself to such terror? Because I don't know, the jank intrigues me. Something opens that. But what does? What opens you? Is there a hole that I'm missing that I can comb through? There is the secret, Billy. Because that's not a go through door, come back door, no. I'm, did I miss something on the climb? Man, I really do need to just sit down and diddly ding actually write down the franchises and games that I want to actually play. I need to hit. Damn you. Yeah, seriously, how do I open you? Are any of the bolt holes, windows, of an actual hole? Because that's not a comeback door. That's, hmm. But at the same time, surely they wouldn't, like, super put a secret... Oh, I think I saw something. I saw a potential thingy. Eh? I think I need to stand on top of the spire! Perhaps. It could have just been... Nope, I need to stand on top of the spire. Aha! Secrets! Because I knew that there wasn't going to be, like, a switch thing f further passed into the level because eh, that's just not the design philosophy. You don't do something at the beginning of the level to access something at the end of the level. That's just not Kirby. It's in the immediate area. Time for boss time. How dare you hit me, bastard. Ah, fool. Ah, huh, that's actually kind of horrifying. Spiky icicles. When he belly flops. And super snowball. Thank God this was super powered. But luckily, we can see that we do indeed need you. And we get souls for it, too. At least I suspect that we want you at the very least. It is possible that we don't require it. But it's just a nice thing to have. Ah, we, we finally found them. Now they must die. Apparently not. Ah. Interesting. I, <laughs> I don't know why, but that kind of intrigues me. It's like, just over a boss arena and nothing else. Just falling blocks. But I, there's no real risk of falling to anything dangerous. Oh no, that doesn't say that it's the end. 
so there has to be Shirley. Aha, I know it. Thank you, developers, for training me and having the foresight of, oh, hey, we should let players know which section they have completed and not. Light bulb time! Take my sunshine! Kirby is illuminated. And they've already turned up the bastardnator up in here. In the darkness, there are bulls, and the bulls say, Ah, <gasps> bastard. They are turning up being a bastard in this section. Or maybe I'm just turning up the being dumb. That is also possible. Damn it, I just realized. Now I, I also want to play, like, Earthbound and Mother 3. Someday. Just way too many things. Too many goddamn games. Games galore. I do, I just need to make a hit list. Maybe I should make, like... I don't know. Maybe a Google Doc or something. And put it out and be like, hey. Here's like... Oh, damn it. But I don't think this resets. Oh, hey, it does reset. Thank you! Horrible abomination that stole the boo sound effect from Mario Bros. But back to thoughts. Perhaps I should just, like, make a... Google document. And be like, hey viewers, these are the games slash game series I kind of want to play through. Thoughts, maybe? I don't know. Once again, the plight of being a small content creator. Damn you, bull man. I'm already being eaten alive by indecision. I do not need to be rammed off by you. And I already know that trick. Although the, the falling floor is a bit mean. And I have to do the run again. <laughs> I do not want to fall to my death. I swear. I hope I don't have to... Uh, hopefully I don't miss any. Okay, that's honestly terrifying. But... Oh no. I've missed some, haven't I? Okay, please say that this is the end. Because, uh... I do not want to backtrack through all this. Don't fight me. Still love the music in here. It's weird, wonky, and I love it. Yeah, I got all the pieces. I've got all the pizzas. Now, I have, now I'm wondering what it would be like if there was like a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles RPG. Because I know there have been beat-em-ups. Oh. I'm not gonna make it. I think I, I got it! I cheated out it! I cheated it! I cheated it, but screw you, game! Oh, that's why. I, how was I supposed to know I could skate over the sludge? I knew I could skate over lava, but it's sludge! I don't know that I can go over sludge. You've never taught me that game. I know that you gave me the power up, so I should have inferred. But still. Be gone. You too, snake. 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 
Oh, I need to do it from the other platform. I am down. Damn you. I shall wait for my opportunity to kill. Okay, a star. Again, it's not a star. It's, it's stolen, but it looks like a star. Oh, I thought he was a floating diddly dee, not a snake. That's why I was aiming weirdly. Ah. I'm dumb. This is why I cement myself as a pretty dumb. And now I shall hide down here from the creepy robots. But boy howdy, I'm just glad that I managed to cheat the game a bit. All right. Definitely interesting. Damn it, I missed that. That even plays a little sound effect when I'm going over a liquid that I can uh, ice skate over. That's interesting. And there's one more down over here. And that's all of them, baby! Huzzah! <laughs> I was like, oh, maybe we should follow the coins. The answer is no, apparently. Maybe I do need you. Oh, damn you! At least I can go through it again. And luckily, these don't just despawn. But I did not know that those guys could actually hurt me. Rude. Wait. Damn you. Me do thing, shut. There's a thing there. Ah, I need to jump. I'm dumb. We've established for this I am dumb. But at the same time... The, the perspective is not the greatest. Oh, no. I hope I don't need that. I beg to God that I do not need Crash. It would be very mean if the game was like, haha, you need Crash. Nope, I got everything. Yay. Boss fight time? Boss fight time. Aha, they actually give me sword. They know me so well. Ah, time for Waifu 2. Neon Boogaloo. Phantom Chloraline. Oh. It's been a while since I've seen this move. Love the design color. Oh. to attack. I love the color of your claws. Bring it on. All right. Dang it, my sword. Yeah, that's interesting. Love the new moves. But luckily, I have new moves too. It's called Dodge. Piccolo would be proud of me. Kamehameha? Oh, X Slash. Thank you for the cool fight! Waifu 2 Electric Boogaloo. I swear to God, if I miss, like, one soul shard, I will cry. Please, for the love of God, please be all of the soul shards I need.
I missed one. Where did I miss one? I thought I got all of the... Ah, yes, this is complete notifications. Bastard. But we'll go back. I guess. And get the DDD power-up. Before coming back and doing that level again. For one soul shard that I somehow missed. I, once again, please, for the love of God, allow me to select sections. That would be nice. But probably also pretty cheatsy to a degree, I guess. It'd be like, eh, how dare you? Just be able to select? No. It would be very nice if I could. Masked Hammer Time! Oh! Oh! It's this mask. I guess it makes sense. It's the one that we thought. Hello there, loading personality. We are going through the final bit of Kirby in the Forgotten Lands here. And, of course, I managed to miss one of the collectibles in the stage that I just played. Of which there were only 51 collectibles, and I missed one. And since we're here, we're gonna go ahead and do this. So we can finally do it. Might as well do it. <laughs> I'll put you on audio mode only to avoid spoilers. Okie dokie! Hopefully my commentary doesn't spoil too much either. I like to commentate on things. So I apologize if spoilers come that way. Begone, woofers. I forget what your in-game Kirby name is. I have hammers, and I'm willing to use them. I'm willing to murder. Face my eternal wrath. Begone, Sandcastle Man. Become 2D Sprite. Begone, ghosts. Begone, Scarfies. I am the man. The man of the plan. And suddenly I'm reminded I really should watch the uh, Gargoyles uh, cartoon series sometime. I hear lots of good things. We have, like, the, one of those funny things from back in the day where they're like, ah, oh, we're going to staple five episodes or so of this TV show together and call it a movie. And it's like a pilot movie. Or maybe it just was a pilot movie. Kind of like, uh, I'm trying to think. It's like a lot of things that did that, but none of them are jumping to my mind. Damn sneak! No war today! I am Kirby! I am the one that commits the war! Not you! That makes me wonder. Does Meta Knight, since he is a Kirby-adjacent being, does he have the ability to swallow enemies whole, and that's why he wears his mask? It's like a, a Hannibal Lecter mask. He was the first Kirby being that's pop star experienced, and now he's been conditioned to loathe his absorbing abilities. And that's why he gives Kirby a sword sword instead of a minion to absorb. He's like, no, Kirby. We shall do this like civilized people. Look at my mask, Kirby. Be civilized like me. Wield sword like man, not Eldritch Abomination from hell. And if I play this right, I'll be able to keep my... Oh, we are running out of time for this treasure trove. Ah! Die, monkey man. I said die, monkey man. Die the monkey can can. I have a I have a magma. Exactly that. I have a mega magma. Another star stone. Literally a full minute late. I wonder what they were expecting me to do better. My optimization. I do not know. And does that open up the last last one? I don't think that it did. Hmm. 
progress through more of the story. All right, then back to the post, 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 post. But first, I'm going to get my sword back. Yes, 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 we are worried about the life of the man that tried to destroy us multiple times. I'm going to become Meta Knight. Mwah. Yeah, this really makes me wonder, what is the final, final boss of this extra section going to be? Because they've added a lot of things. Even if this is like a... Best selection diddly D. And updated enemies a little bit to be like, Aha, you thought you knew, but you do not. All right, now I beg of you game, please let me select section. Nope, does not look like it get to select section. It is uh, all or nothing. As I now have to look for one frickin' shard. Oh, he actually comments on that. There's only one soul shard left to find, but where is it? Is that meant to commentate on me or you, game? I ponder. It'd be kind of funny if after all this time I'd be like, aha, I tricked the game. But no, the game tricked me. Because <laughs> I did manage to finagle that one soul when it should have fallen into the abyss, so perhaps I should be happy that I'm getting the soul, <laughs> got as many souls as I did. I swear. Damn you, parade of monsters. Oh, uh, uh, oh. It was right there, but you thought you said, I thought you said. I thought that this area said, haha, you got all of them. Or did I just give myself like a diddly dee? I'm trying to think of the word. Did I just lull myself into a false sense of security because I was like, oh no, how do I get that there? So, where is the mysterious locking mechanism? Because surely it is in this area, and then I found it, and then I did it, and I'm like, aha, I did it, and thought that I secured ultimate victory. Is that what happened? I am a fool. But hey, at least we get to fight Neon Waifu Electric Boogaloo 2 again. So I guess there's some ups and ups. Ah, he even says we've got all the pieces in this area already. So that's kind of nice. So if you're replaying, actively looking for soul pieces, he actually tells you. Bastard! Yes, he tells you bastard. Totally not me. And now he's somersaulting everywhere. He's somersaulting my eyes. And we don't need your body. We don't need your ability up in here. Granted, some of the, the food would have been nice, but no. That bullet was coming for me. Run, Kirby! Run from the bullet! If you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a bullet. Now I'm just starting to think, like, what the hell would happen if you just, like, inserted Kirby into, like, various movies? Kirby Fight Club. Kirby Fight Club where the, uh, diddly do the soap guy, I forget his name. The guy that gets our main character into the fight club in the first place is like, <laughs> the main character is Kirby, and then the fight club mean guy is Meta Knight. Don't know where my brain came up with this, but I'm loving it. Ba 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 ba. I haven't had McDonald's in years. And really no regret there. Damn it, I fell off the ledge. I think that's McDonald's provoking chaos magic, magic to be like, Ugh, you think you're safe? You think you're safe from us clowns? You're 
not. Still love the funky music for this section. And this level in general back in into normal level. Again, Kirby music is like a genre unto itself, and it is magical. And, uh, yeah, I'll just take the snowman so we can traverse this area easier. Be gone, sludge. I did not know that I could slide over. Just... I'm however... I'm, I'm, I am however many hours into this Kirby game... And I'm still learning the proper functions of this Kirby game. It's like when I'm fighting the literal final boss. And I'm like, hey, I think I finally got dodging down. You know, at the final boss. Well, better than frickin' Tales of Fantasia. Where it took... I got to the final boss. And then I'm like, oh no. I have... Uh gone and uh, need to grind. Even though I'm still probably going to replay Tales of Fantasia soon. And I still don't know what I want to do. Do, do I want to play like two games that I want to play back to back? Or uh, do I want to go and like oh, get bastard? Or do I want to do like an RPG alongside a shorter game? Especially considering how many, like, open-world games and RPGs are on my hit list. Just way too many games. Too many games. Too many RPGs. But now back to fighting Super Waifu 2 Electric Boogaloo. Yeah, come get me. If you can. Aha! I'm the Super Dodge Man. Still love the new moves. Damn it, I got hit. There goes my laser beams. No. My laser beams are so helpful. Oh, that, that was an awesome effect. Aha! Super dodge! I'm still sad that, like, Cyberpunk 2077 wasn't that amazing a game. Especially when this game has better, like, neon claws of Cyberpunk definition than actual Cyberpunk did. <laughs> Shadow Clone Jutsu time. No. 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 I am the Dodge Master. No. No. Oh, yeah, X Factor. And goodbye. Booyah. And of course, uh, I'm still shocked that I managed to, like, mess with my own mind and be like, ah, oh, yes, because I solved the final puzzle thingamajig of getting these pieces, I did indeed get all the pieces when, no, I, I missed one. Because I'm dumb. I am Le Fool. Man, but at least we got all the pieces. Because, you know, we can't have it just be 50 pieces. It has to be 51. Granted, it wouldn't even out anyway, because now we're to, what, uh, 149? Yep. Almost halfway there. Or maybe halfway there. I do not know. But from the looks of things, four more levels. Four go horns. 51 soul pieces here. All right, time to go mole. You'll come out and become my power if you want to die. What? Oh, I 
think I get it. Maybe I need to do the shaker power. Oh yeah, that's what we need to do. Shaker power, go! Die, monster. You do not belong in this world. This world that is my world. Or is it his world, as I point to Sonic the Hedgehog? Sonic the Hedgehog. Sonic the Sonic. And now I've, now I've just gone through and be like, hmm, Sonic Media. It is sad that Sonic Satayim did not get a proper ending. Think you're safe on your tiny island? You are not safe. Because I am here. You think you can throw rocks at me while I'm underground? You fool! I kind of like how things are going with this extra section of the game. I still wonder how they're going to, like, end it off. I'm still intrigued by that. But we'll just have to wait and see what the end is like. Mouthful time! I am the vending machine. Oh. Oh no. I hope that I... Uh, I think I got punked. Yeah, from the looks of things, I just got punked. Okay, I did not... I'm going to restart the level. I did not realize that I only had like five bloody soda cans. That's kind of mean. All the other soda cans, dispensers, have been like, yeah, have five billion of them. Or at the very least, like, 20 or so. A decent amount. And then comes the, this guy, like, you only have, like, five. Why would screw you? Pain and agony. Agony and pain. Pain Agony. It's like Saint a Anthony, but uh, evil. Pain Agony. But let us see. Let me think of things. As we scream. Diddly -diddly -diddly. I just realized that this power kind of makes Kirby into, like, a Graboid. He goes underground, he kind of drags you along. Your enemies are in constant pain as you drag them along. Kind of like the franchise. It's just in agony as it gets dragged along. Alright, let's see. I have three frickin' sodas, and I can't shoot them. I have to go through this obstacle course without shooting fear. Damn it, now I've just realized another game series that I kind of want to get through someday. Breath of Fire. At least the iconic ones on PlayStation... Which PlayStation? PlayStation 1 or 2? Blarg. But okie do. We'll keep in mind. Game is getting crueler on uh, how to do these segments. Which I guess is somewhat fair enough to a degree. But at the same time, ow. <gasps> I just realized the boy didn't say that we got him all. We have to restart again. God damn it. I almost did the thing again where I got hyper-fixated hyper on doing one part of the diddly. So that when it finally came down to when I got it, I'm like, oh yeah, 
I did it. I got the one that I was thinking about while doing the majority of the level. And then came about the annihilation of all when I realized, oh yeah, the boy didn't say we got them all. Back to the drawing board, Billy. Back to the pain and agony. I just need to be super duper. I need to be like Frankie, super super. As I look and pray and hope. Bippity boppity boo. At least I don't think that he said. The, we got them all. It's entirely possible that my memory is so shot that I, for whatever reason, blanked it out. Nope, there is the suit. I forgot that you exist. Pain and agony. Pain and agony. Even when they have a literal thing saying, hey, we'll tell you when you get everything, my brain just and goes, ah, I must have gotten everything because the pain is over. When really, the pain is just beginning. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Uh, Digimon Survive finally got a, a release date. It's in June. And now I need to decide, hmm, do I want to get that game? And do I want to play it like, where do I want to play it? Because there are so many goddamn games that I want to play. Like, I want to play uh, Digimon uh, Cyber Sleuth, both Hacker's Memory and Normal. So I need to do that sometime. Who knows, maybe that should be my next game. It's kind of split right now between that and... Uh, Ba-ba-ba. Wait! I don't think the boy said it. Did the boy say it? I wish I could, like, check in with the boy. Boy, did I get all the souls? Am I the Elden Lord, boy? Ah, you. Almost lost you. There we go. I can't believe I almost did it like a third time. But I managed to not. So yay. Ah. Brain. Alright, it is throwing monkeys at me. So we want to do hammer time. Granted, the original section of this uh, level eh, was, was also hammer time, so. Damn you. Oh, but I didn't even need to fire my fire. It just worked. Huzzah. I hate you, water. Be gone from my sight, you abomination of abominations. Booyah! Super speed! And we don't even have a subsection to go down. Double yay. And this way for secret. Scream all you want, monkey. The world ain't gonna hear you. The DK crew won't save you. You will never be a member of the DK crew. <laughs> the ultimate. <laughs> There's gotta be so many memes that you could plop that into. It's just like... 
somebody listening intently as you cruelly lean in and say, you will never be a member of the DK crew, and they just sob. <laughs> oh no, it could be like that uh, meme of a lady that's shouting knives into a guy's chest, and the words could be, you will never be a member of the DK crew. Ow. Rude. Just drop an icicle on me, bastard. <laughs> Sleep time. I can get a second health bar. Mwahaha. Oh no, I don't get a second health bar, instead I get attack power up. Oh. I forgot that it's randomized. And there goes my sword. Well, not sword. My... Uh... I'll call it a battle axe, just so I can be wrong on everything. Why be wrong on some accounts when you can be wrong on all of them? Just a lot of chaos going on. Chaos, chaos. I can do anything. I still need to play a uh, Delta Room. I actually played through uh, Undertale on this Twitch stream not super duper long ago. It was last year, I believe. So I really should be getting to Deltarune chapter diddly and chapter that. Oh. <laughs> Instead of the one thing, it's a cone. Subverting expectations, I see. die. And now out of the way. Make room for Spiky Head Boy. Alright, I'm gonna leave. Mm, I don't know. Let me just quickly test something. Okay, good. There is no secret over there. Just wanted to make triply sure. Now conify me, Captain. It's like codify me, but it's with cone. I don't think it meant for me to do it like that, but I did anyway. Haha. -ha. Fool, I know how to manipulate your mechanics. Idiot. I don't need a degree to manage your mechanics. Once more, we'll take this as a sign of, I should probably take that ability. Be gone, Satan. how we act activate that. I'll be right back. Oh, good. It's like, are we actually going to have a side section? Why are we going to have a side section? How dare you? Oh, how are we going to have a side section? They, these level thingies don't have side sections. And uh, they don't. Just on the offhand chance, just in case. Oh. Oh, that's cruel. That is actually cruel. They have little the charger gems popping in during a mini boss fight. Why in the world would you be so cruel? Scared of missing one of them. Stop trying to shoot me with tornadoes. Damn you. Okay, 
Okay, it seems to be mostly just one per fight, and it happens really quick in the middle of, of right at the start, so. Alright. I think I can forgive this mechanic. But still, not something I expected to see up in here. I'm gonna assume one more. Yeah, because I think that's all of the mini-bosses that are in the game. Okay, good. I was scared there for a second that he was gonna hit me, and in my stun frames, I wouldn't be able to actually get to the damn thing. I think the bosses actually block the wind stream. That is funny. Alright, I beg of thee, please be the end. Maybe some down the secret. Nope, that's all. But I thought they kept the secret. All right, at least we didn't need the gun for the secret. Not a terribly important secret, but still nice to have. And onwards we go. All right. This is interesting. I'll take you, because I feel like we're going to have to do some shooting. This is different. This is interesting. Definitely interesting. I'm just jumping between two frickin' boats. I... <laughs> I will say this, I did not expect this out of Kirby. I do not begrudge that it is here, though. It is interesting, and I like interesting. But now the question is, where's the secret we're gonna screw you? Alright. Don't think that's the secret we're gonna screw you, but it... Huzzah. Die. One of these guys, uh, um, hmm. I wonder. No. Oh, I can actually jump while still on. Okay, that's a nice one. What the hell? I, I pressed the, hey, I would like to move button, and then the game laughed at me and said no. I've never seen that happen before. Quick detour as I, oh. Oh, now that. That was potentially cruel game. That was potentially cruel game. And we got all of them at the very least, so huzzah. Die, fireboy. Fear me. I will annihilate you, fireboy. And now I'm suddenly reminded that I haven't consumed anything related to My Hero Academia in a long time. Let us see. I like that it plays it again. His illusionary nemesis. Oh, now he's throwing Gordos. Oh, he's gonna body slam me. Oh, he's gonna chain body slam me. How dare. At least I can do this. Thank you for the ability recommendation, game. Ha! Take that! 
Once again, I thank the dear lo- Oh, that's- That's just mean, game! Oh. Okay, not terribly mean, but still, interestingly mean. Haha, take that. I dodge. Aha, take that. I dodge. Wow, I unintentionally dodged. And then I last minutely dodged. I was gonna say something. Oh, yeah. I am super thankful that the game does not have a little challenge achievement things I need to do on top of basically speeding through highlights of all the levels throughout the game. Because I don't think I would have been able to handle it. I s a crueler game would have gone, oh, yeah, by the way. On top of having to look through for all of these, we're also going to have little achievement daily challenges like the Waddle Dees in the main area. So if you want to get all of them, well, you have to do these arbitrarily annoying things. Oh, thank God. I got them all in that one. I had to restart the level like four times, but I did it. <laughs> Big Rig. Off the road truckers. Big fucking rigs! Two slash three levels left, I do believe. Huzzah. All right, 49 shards in this level. Let's -a go. Okay, interesting. I shall peck at you. I'm like Pikachu in the water. Wah. I'm gonna leave. Oh, no, oh, I, I, I thought there was gonna be a gun guy there. It's a mole. So die, mole. Damn you. Double damn you. Be gone, bunny. You do not get to jump up and down on this land anymore. Woot woot. Ah hell, I almost died. But I shall not. I refuse to. I move on. Look for secrets. Not really a secret, but it is healing, and we do not begrudge healing. Wow, that, the mole responds. That's nice to know. And on we go. Tre treacherous doom. Oh. That was already falling. So we gotta play it super safe. I forgot how just how open ended this section of the world is. Or this level. How ever so slightly it is big and winding. Hmm. Because the game is kind of poking at me, hey, do bombs. I feel like I'll need you. You have new level specific attacks? Okay. Interesting. Caught up in the tornado of doom. At least I thought I did. I somehow managed to escape the tornado of doom. Alright, because I think I'll need you. I think I'll need your power. I do need your power. Thank you. 
Thank you for your sacrifice. I'll keep the bomb guy alive, because I want to say I might need him. We shall ignore that for now, as we head up here. Hello, bunnies. Boss time, or just do? And now I'm reminded, for some reason, that I need to go and play Code Vein again sometime. I got to, like, a certain part, and then I just stopped for some reason. It might be an interesting stream game. I do not know. Ah, good thing I ignored that. It wasn't time. Mwaha. But I haven't been told that I've gotten all the souls yet, so I'm worried. Scared. Okay, good. That's all of them. Thank you. Thank you. Come again. That was just the first part. Oh, thank goodness. Dang it. I thought I was going to get through without getting sludged. But then the sludge came for me. Why is that up there? Grab you and then run back. Die. See an enemy man? Literally the worst superhero. See an enemy man. He sees an enemy and then we all die. Begone, Toad Man. Be hydrated and fear. Quit spitting at me before I murder your family. Oh, I forgot that that's, act that's an actual part of the actual level. Man. Silly me. Time for more hydration. Get down here and suffer. Get down here and die. Get down here and confess your crimes. And once again, we haven't gotten the all clear. We've done all the things things. So I'm scared. I need to... Aha! Uh -huh. I think I got gotcha. you. I think I maybe. Hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully. Okay, thank God. And please, be all that I require. We shall go. We shall see. Is this victory? It is victory! Yes! We have done it. We have saved the world. We did it, Patrick. We saved the town. Screams of fear in the background. We did it, Patrick. We killed everybody. Die, fish. No one loves you. Ah, uh, crap. How many sodas do I have this time? A hundred, so don't have to worry too much. But I'm still gonna be paranoid. Ever so slightly. I'm not just gonna spam needlessly. Okay, first things first. I'm gonna take a look at what's ahead. Okay, never mind. We do need it in uh, vending machine form. Still love this rendition. 
Oh, please don't tell me that I uh, automatically progress. Good. I don't know why there's squids in here. Squid game. Splatoon, maybe. Still haven't played any Splatoon game, so like there was the like demo test thing they did once on the Wii U when I had terrible internet. But aside from that, no. I don't think this is what they want me to do, but I shall do it anyway. I hope to God that that's a satisfactory game. Because I can't really... Prepare to get combed, boy. Get out of here. Die. Die, seal man. Sman. You'll fear me because I am Kirby. I destroy your recycling. That's just mean. It literally spawns me on top of the guy to kill him. Granted, at the same time, I do need this. Literally. Because I don't think we'd be able to do that with even with invincibility frames. Once again, my sincerest thanks. Oh, yay, we got everything in this section. Yay. My sincerest thanks to the composers. Because, again, this is one of my favorite Kirby games up in here. Damn it, I could have used you. I could have used your soul energy. And I've just realized that I've never read or watched Bleach. Maybe one of these days I should rectify that. Especially because I think it's getting a revival. Because I think, th like, the one thing that I knew about Bleach, aside from, ah, yes, like, uh, Phantom Sword People, was that it got horrifically cancelled. Like, I think even the manga, to a degree, got cancelled. Or, uh, not cancelled, but was super forced to, uh, to rush things along by the upper directives. People up at the top said, hey, we want you to finish this now. And things weren't super satisfactory, and now all of a sudden, the, uh, there's gonna be like an anime redo continuation? I don't know. All I know is something anime bleach is coming in the sometime, maybe, future. That's the best kind of future, the sometime, maybe. Give me my spiky hat back! It is my spiky hat, not yours. Nice. I did it. I'm the man who did. Not you. Me. I am the did man. You've heard of the bad guy. Now get ready for the did man. Die. And now, for some reason, saying die reminds me of uh, some of the Zelda games that I'm never going to play. The uh, Wand of Gamelon and uh, Faces of Evil, I think. It's just like a uh, big hefty no. Bro. Bro. 
be gone, Scarfy. Oh, yeah, I forgot this music is funky. I forgot how stupid this music is. I love it. Quick, somebody find the shittiest kazoo. We must have it for our musical endeavors. Fear the power of the shittiest kazoo. <laughs> and somehow I didn't die there. Be gone, Scurfy. And now the music was reminding me of something. Maybe Diablo? I don't know. Light up all the lights. Give me all the lights of the world, Billy. Ah. Ow. Funny that it gives me the fire ability right as it gives me the blow power. Die. Oh yeah, we didn't even get to the best part of the song. Wait. The boy didn't say that was it. The boy! The boy! Where is it? Where's the, ah, there's the secret passage. I do not remember this level at all. I don't even think it was a level. And once again, I don't think the boy said anything. Miss that much? Do, 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 do. Oh, that just appeared. Me dumb. Okay, good. We didn't have to backtrack through the entire level. Only like half of it. Luckily, we have this funky music to groove out to. Even if we did have to backtrack through all of it. And now it'll be boss time, I do believe. Woot woot. So maybe we'll actually make decent time. I, f I feared that with so many diddly dees to worry about, that this would be another grind session. Armor plated illusion. Oh, he throws bombs! Take that, sucker! Does he have stickers on him? Come on, try me! Try me! Try me! Oh, he's ready to go right again. I just remembered, I also want to play Dot Hack! I'll probably emulate of the original dot hacks because they get ridiculously expensive once you get to like the last ones and as much as okay this is gonna be new potentially I am not your dance partner man okay. as much as I like doing things authentically with like real games uh game software uh, and uh, do not condone like downloading and emulating recent games considering that there is no modern way of getting the dot hack games from the PlayStation 2 as far as I'm aware as far as I'm aware there's no way to actually legally get them it's only through second hand which is ridiculously expensive so I'm just like eh. <laughs> I think I told the line there. Also doesn't help that even if they were, like, available through, like, the PlayStation 3 digital store, they'd be like, oh, yeah, $60 for each game. And it'd be like, 
I am full of anger. Ooh, adventure together. Bandana Waddle Dee and Elphalyn have joined Kirby's victory dance. Kirby's dancing is cute and carefree, but his singing voice is super powerful. Let's all sing along with him next time. Woohoo! Great job, Kirby! So, one to two more levels. Let us see how much we have to go. Let's see, can I check the stage list? 50, 48, 51, 51, 49, and then the last one. And then, I guess, the final, final boss. Let us go, Billy! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let us see if we have to suffer much. Or if we can get through this handy dandy. Handy dandy notebook. Swipe or no swiping? You will fear my power. Now I just remember that I also kind of want to play through uh, the movie tie-in games for like the... Uh, some of the Star Wars movies. But those have the legendary score of the legendary composer man. And that gets, like, instantly copyright, uh, claimed. It, it's probably so copyright that if it played while I was streaming, the stream would probably be shut down. That is the power of, uh, I think John Williams is his name-o. Love the music. Again, hope that I am not... Oh, there's checkpoints? Ah, I just realized it tells you when checkpoints happen. Nice. Love this music. And we still have secrets to go. Oh, there it is. Wow. I didn't even realize. Nice. Thank you, Trail of Coins. And we did it. Collected all fragments in this area. Man, I love how the these levels are flowing so far. And just goes to show that I want more of this HAL Laboratory. I want more of this type of Kirby. Because this type of Kirby is fantastic. How dare you be frozen and die. Now I'm suddenly reminded that I have, like... Once again, the plight of being a small content creator. Because there's so many ideas of creativity that I want to do. Like, uh, go over... Uh, like the certain story ideas of like how I think Frozen, despite being this huge thing, like uh, could have been so much better. But I just don't have like the time to commit to something like that nowadays. I can't believe I'm surviving this. Hopefully they're not going to work in a, hey, you need Crash. That would be mean. Like, haha, you need crash. That would just be cruel. I get it for like, haha, do this once to save a Waddle Dee, but like go into a full-on level and be like, ah, ah, it would just, it would just hurt. Da, 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 da. Love the music. And all I got was a hot dog. 
Somebody call Sanic. That guy's a chili dog. And he'll never have it back. I don't think I need you. Ah, I just got a capsule. Sadness. Man, that just looks creepy. The soul disturbed like a flame bro. That's more like a cactus now. Is that all the souls? No, it is not. Shit. This is why we backtrack. Da, 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 da. Faster. Still wonder why that the Beast Pack were like, we're gonna make our base in the uh, dark ditches of a lava volcano. Who in their right mind would come here? Then again, their leader was not really in his right mind. So I guess they kind of have an excuse. A little bit of one. And they did come around in the end, so hey. But still, this does not seem like it would be all that hospitable a place to live. My hat! I need you. It's like if uh, Luffy needed his hat for his powers. Trying to think of where the hell the missing shard is for this level. Hello, missing shard. Interesting that I can actually get the camera to turn all the way up here. That's interesting. Where the hell is the missing shard? Kirby, and where the hell is the last shard? The sequel we all were waiting for. Still love the music though, but wait. Back in moment. Aha! That was sneaky. Very sneaky. And it wasn't. Oh! It wasn't it. That wasn't the last one. Oh god. Oh god. Oh shit. Fuck. Damn it. Another Halloween. Where the bloody hell? Where the bloody dale dell? Where the bloody dingo dial? Like, that is honestly a, a terrible feeling. You're playing through a level and you're like, aha, I found potentially the thing that I was looking for and has been missing. And then the game just kicks you in the nuts and says, haha, idiot, fool, moron, fool. There's more. So now you have to begin the cycle anew. Where are they? Where are the secret Spitty Bones? Billy Bam Bane Junson man. Spitty Bones Juice Boy. I'm losing my mind. I'm losing my mind. Because I'm avoiding obstacles like crazy. 
and then losing my mind and jumping to my doom. Is that a cave that I can go in, or is that just death? It's probably just death. Ay ay ay. Ay ay ay, I'm losing my mind. Maybe I can fly around this side looking for clues. The answer is no. Happy what the hell day. The day that everybody loves. Seriously, I go through, I'm like, aha, I find secret, and then there's like, aha, there's more. And now I'm just like, what the hell? My brain. My brain. My brain. I don't want to go forth. Oh, aha. I did it, Dad. Yay. I was just about to say, it's like, I don't want to continue on and make progress when I'm only going to have to replay this section even though I'm going walking through a billion times. Ah! And I did it. I eventually did it. I'm going to eat this maximum tomato. Oh, holy shit, that goes fast. You bastard. Oh no, oh no. I don't think I'll need bombs, because I don't think there's anything bong b bong. Anything a bomb specific that I would really require the bomb powers for. That would be a very interesting Kirby power-up. It's Bong Kirby! Everyone should fear the power of Bong Kirby. Just like I should fear the power of I actually need Bomb Kirby. Profound sadness. Aha! I did it. Well, that makes me wonder. Will we ever see a weed Kirby? The most powerful Kirby of all. things go, the more I lose my soul. <laughs> Before, we had to uh, actually open it up. This time, we have to go fast. Gotta 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 go fast. Running at the speed of sound, fastest hedgehog around, got ourselves a situation into a new location without any shitty diddy. Meh. Let me in so I can get all the coins. And then I fly. Oh boy. Are you ready to die? Fools. Be gone! You have angered me. Give me that soul! That beast did! Just auto smack me! Just walk up, open my front door, say hello, and eat my wife. 
Granted, that would basically just describe Kirby in his everyday life. He's probably eaten multiple wives over his life, surely. Get out of the way, Mole Man. Mole Man Supreme. Mole Man Mediocre. Mole Man 3, The Revengeoning. And Mole Man Be Gone. Bastard. Mole Man Be Gone. And let me guess. They're gonna put a soul here. No, but they did put coins. Which is almost as good as a soul. Because, yeah, now we have to dig around this area just to make sure. No, just lots of coins. Are you trying to screw with me? You trying to screw Kirby? Sadly, there's a lot of people that won't do that. It's very weird, the internet. But time for a roller coaster ride. Oh god, this is gonna be horrifying, isn't it? It's gonna be super fast. Luckily, I should be able to redo it if I miss any Oh, you bastard! Bastard! Bastard 2, electric... <coughs> that wasn't me reacting to anything, that was just me making the noise, because that's part of the title. Bastard! It's like, aha, you want to stick your neck out for whatever's gonna be here. Oh, thank God, the last one was right there. I was gonna be like, no, how did I miss any? And I didn't. That's the truth. I got everything. I am the Master Man. Master Man, Master Man. Three. And they would have let me retry it if I wanted. Yay. But I noticed. That's not everything. Die. Give me that soul. Is that all? That's all souls for this area. Huzzah! I don't know why I'm gathering this much money. I don't think I'm gonna have a point for it. Because I think I've gotten everything that I can spend money on. Well, I guess there is the rebuyable diddly daws. The maximum tomato in my pocket. The temporary power boosts and speed boosts and stuff. What? Why have I got to go mouthful mode for this? Now, uh, this is interesting. He's stabbing Balloon Kirby. He's a bastard. The guy stabbing Balloon Kirby, not Balloon Kirby himself. That's not why he's being stabbed. Die. I already have swords, so I don't need you. Oh, good. I Good thing I did not spit out mouthful mode. Then again, I guess I could have gone back for the actual water spout and gotten the mouthful mode again. But I don't know how this game works. Maybe it wouldn't have let me go back. I do not know. I am not psychic. I have not seen the things that this game has seen. So I need to beat each boss using mouthful mode. Interesting. Bunkers, please! Bunkers has gone bunkers! It's the end of the world! For a moment there, I thought that there was one, but no, I had, I had... I just have to go to this world, this right side. Be gone, Satan. I jump. And then I become the key. Surrender the carrots, rabbit. How many uh, Coca-Colas do I have? 777. Lol.
die, bastards. I am God. You will fear me. You will give in to me. And I will rule the world. I didn't even use 77 Coca-Colas. Yeah. Kirby time. Are you ready to die? I don't think I'll need either of you. You're just recommendations. Wait. Where was the cone? Oh, I guess I'd get the cone after this because otherwise, then it would just be, hey, use the cone, beat the, <laughs> destroy the arena. Die, monster. You do not belong in this world. Leave me alone. I am Meta Knight. Yep, I knew it. Gave me the cone. Goodbye, building. I did it. I saved the world. And that's all the parts for this. Which means there's only the boss fight left, I do believe. Oh, this is a cool kind of rundown. Yay. I shall do this with my sword. Feral Nemesis time! Illusionary Primal Nemesis. Oh my god! They went nuts for this fight. Kirby is scared. Attack, attack. Especially because this is a two, uh... Okay, that's nope. Take this! Come on, you're touching the lava. Die, pig boy. And then he becomes a pig boy. Oh yeah, sure, just summon meteors from the sky. Sure. Yeah. No. Dang it, I forgot the lava appears. Oh sure, cause a temper tantrum. Play the bongos all you want. You're still gonna die. I hate you. Once again, you're in the lava. Okay, I thought that one existed in hell. Get away, Billy! I... I fear for my life. Dead. He is in the lava. Why? Goodbye. But I still did it. I won the day. Hopefully.
Because once again, I would not want to replay this level again so soon. Because it is a marathon. Especially with that final boss. And once again, I reiterate, Ultimate Arena is going to eat me alive. Please complete it. Please be all. Please be all. Please say I didn't be dumb. Yes, I did it. I saved the day. Ah, deep sleep. Hmm. Walk to bed and get all cuddly cozy. You'll show everyone your full potential after you wake up. That's a lie. But I did it. How many fragments do we require now, or is it all of them? Do we have all of them? We have all of them. Oh boy. You have collected all the pieces of Leon's soul. As proof of your courage, you've earned a special figure. That's it, I get a figure. Oh boy. <gasps> Neat. Leon and Carol. These two were the famous leaders of the Animal Kingdom until Leon found IDF-86. After that, he began speaking in a language Carol couldn't understand. She only speaks and meows and formed the Brule Beast Pack. Still, she still believed in him, so she formed a new identity of her own and followed along. So from the looks of it, you don't need all 300. The pieces of Leon's soul you collected are shining in the direction of their owner. You can sense Leon Gar on that forgotten isolated isle. Hurry and help him! After we head back to Waddle Dee Town, rest, and uh, get him a maximum tomato that we can take with us into the final hell. I heard there's a present goat hidden somewhere in town. Let's find it. Find it yourself. To a rival point, you can play the beginning thing. I didn't realize you could actually walk backwards like that. I didn't realize that was an actual way you could go. Helfalin is a, is a real friend. He's like, hey, Kirby, your health looks a little low. You should rest up. And now we're going to place our own figures down. Well, first we need to find the figures that we're going to take away. <gasps> That's adorable! Kirby actually looks at them! Kirby admiring his figure collection. That's hilarious. That could be a meme if people wanted it to. But of course... There we go. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Wait. Oh, there we go. The three best figures that I currently have are now up and presented in my Kirby house. I want a Maxim Tomato in my pocket. But Kirby, you don't have any pockets. In my pocket! And now on we go. Let's talk to uh, Carol. Don't worry, I'm sure we'll find Leon Gar in there. Once he returns, your pack will finally have its old leader back. Just have, wait a bit longer. And on we go to the final bit, which is probably going to be Super Boss Rush. That's gonna be fun. Super Boss Rush against the Lion, the Eldritch Abomination, and my Husbando. Well, that's what I can only assume. It's entirely possible that it's just Leongar. But who knows? Oh boy. Oh, great! Now, even that's creepy! 
Of course it has to be creepy. It's the it's the super final boss of a Kirby game. Hello, albino Leon Gar. Oh boy, you get your own cutscene. You're going to... Okay, good. You're just going to give him his soul back. But this is a level. It would be hilarious if it just didn't go into a boss fight. But if this is a level. And it was creepy back there. This is going to be a boss fight. <laughs> Leon is just looking at us. He's going to hit us. Oh no, he actually poses. Oh, nope, here we go. That was, that was hilarious. It's like he was like, what is this pink guy doing? Possessed beast, Forgo Leon. We have to stop Leongar. Use this. I already have what I need. Ah, shit. No! Besides, weren't you already possessed? Ah, uh, hell. No. Dang it, I got hit, so there goes my laser beams. Here we go. Kamehameha laser beam. How is this going to be changed? Or will it? Still that scream. I feel sorry for you, boy. You actually were happy to see us save you, and now you're possessed again. I beat you up. Dang it. Dang it. I free you! Now for phase two. Oh boy, now you're even creepier! why I have a maximum tomato. Once again, thank God I don't have to do this without getting hit. Oh boy, it gets worse. He summons rocks from hell. Utterly terrifying. Dang it, I got hit there. No, my sword! Oh, great. A phase three? It is angry. What the hell? Okay. Oh, hey. Bastard! Fuck, fuck. Okay. No. Nice view of his crotch. This thing just really wants to keep its toy, huh? Be gone! Okay, so maybe we won't get my husbando as a super fuck. Nope, it looks like we're gonna get it anyway. Psychic Beast Soul Forgo! Butterfly? Butterfly, why? Don't get absorbed, butterfly. Oh. What? Morphonite, it's this bastard 
again! Okay, I have I forget where I last saw you. Probably in uh, Robobot or uh, Triple Deluxe, but I did not I did not expect you. It's freaking Galactonite's brother or something. What the hell? I literally just did not expect you. I should have known. Kirby games like throwing the Super Knights at us every now and then. I thought we were going to get a uh, Fecto uh, Elphilis uber boss. No, we're getting a bonus boss, which is uh, kind of super... Oh shit. Well, that's not nice at all. We're getting a Super Meta Knight. Dodge like crazy. I am Kirby drunk. Fuck. I'm probably gonna have to get good at the Leon Gar fight so I can take on this guy with a maximum tomato. Dang it. No. Dang it. But yeah, I just... Ah, oh, fuck, I did it again. I just did not expect... This, the Butterfly Knight guy to come back. The moment I saw, like, a colorful Meta Knight-looking guy, I was like, Galactonite? No. It's worse. Oh, yeah, it's worse. I'm gonna die. I hope to God that there's, uh, checkpoints. I hate you. I thought you would do it only once. No. How am I supposed to dodge this while Kirby drunk? This is gonna be my first Kirby death. I do believe. Yep, my first death. Luckily, I only lose coins. But now I'm gonna have to do the whole fight over again. I'm getting homing bombs. Oh no, we just get to fight Morpho Knight again. Double bastard. I miss my sword. I really wish they would have given me a bigger selection of abilities to have chosen from. I dodged through that. Screw you, game. You want to be super specific with hitboxes? Let me have my all my uh, my abilities to choose from. Throw bombs. Don't even bother. Just throw bombs. The homing bombs will find him. Get him. Get him. It's nice that he kind of uses the, uh, the dragon flight move to 
get to me. <laughs> Sorry, Morpho Knight. You steal my uh, sword, I throw bombs like a bitch. Why dodge when I can just jump away? <laughs> Fool. Dang it. Go cry to your mom, Morpho Knight. But yeah, it is utterly terrifying that Morpho Knight just hijacked the super invasive vortex monstrosity as a butterfly. As just a freaking butterfly, he flies in and hijacked a boss fight. Bastard, quit spamming your attacks. It's my job. God, the quick, sudden change of movement. Once again, I'm supposed to dodge that how while drunk, and this guy is a spamming bastard when it comes to his drunk attack. <laughs> Now he's sending multiple of them. Dang it. I beat you by being a bastard myself. Take that, Morpho Knight. You have the honor of being the only thing in this game to kill me so far. Not as super presentation as uh, Fecto Elphilus. But yeah, it was much harder. Especially because he's a spammer, like me. I did it again. Blueprint? You got the Morpho Knight Sword Blueprint. You can now evolve the sword ability. How many freaking gemstones is that going to take? Yo, Leongar. I had to fight you twice. Then I fought an ancient evil from a different game. Or is he dead? Would be ballsy of them to just kill a character like this. Especially because it's the body. The body... Le oh, no! Carol has his last soul piece. Oh, no, they... Aw, I get it. Leon Gar had a piece of himself and all of his allies. Who I've been slaughtering through this entire game. Please don't fight me again. You're now back to normal, my dude. I saved you by beating you up. I did it. I killed everyone and saved them by killing them. 
So yeah, Ultimate Arena is going to be a pain in the ass. Credits to Electric Boogaloo. Well, while the credits roll again, unless something interesting pops up again, I will give my overall thoughts again on Kirby as well as... I guess I'll start... I will start with the uh, uh, Forgo Dreams as a base to spring off of because that's the new thing that we did. Also, is that actual... Uh, I forget his name. I, can I for keep forgetting his name. The Da-Da-Da Woods guy that's in every Kirby game. Is that actually him outside the window? Because it, it looks like him. He has the normal nose. He's the normal proportions. And he isn't a palm tree. He's a normal fluffy tree. But... Yeah, I, I think I really liked that post-game there. The post-game was... Uh, they, they did the good thing. They just added new, interesting moves to bosses. And not just, oh yeah, they have a billion more health. Granted, Morpho Knight was pushing it a little bit, it felt like. <laughs> but, yeah. It's interesting because it, they remixed the levels a bit. They remixed the mini-bosses as well. They remixed the main bosses. And the cool thing is, is that it tied in with the story. So, yeah. I'm kind of sad that we didn't get a Fecto Elphilus Ultra Mode, though. Because I feel like that would have been friggin' badass. Utterly and horrifically. But at the same time... They gave us Morpho Knight again. I forget where uh, Galactonite came from. Because I think Galactonite might have been from Meta Knight's Revenge. Or, like, the Meta Knight mode where you played uh, the... I think it was in Kirby Super Deluxe? No. Not Kirby Super Deluxe. Kirby Superstar Ultra. In Kirby Superstar Ultra, the one that had multiple campaigns, you were able to go and play through uh, a variant of the final campaign. Oh yeah, sure, taunting me with Ultimate Arena. I am not going to do that today because Ultimate Arena is hell. Oh no. Oh no, they're promising me what I wanted. Ultimate Fecto, oh, oh. They're promising me Fecto Elphilus Ultimate Mode. I fear. It can't be today. We went long enough. But another day we will give a try to... It's nice. Kirby has a new dad that isn't just DDD. But, yeah. The Ultima Arena is there. To eat my soul. But we're not going to do that today. We're just going to jump in see if there's anything new beyond just the Ultimate Arena. Like, let's... Yes, yes. Ultimate Arena. Ultimate Fecto... Elphilus. On top of Morpho Knight. That I have to do in a single run! Ultimate Cup Z. Ooh. Not today. Not today, Satan. Then again, we do have the potential for Morpho Knight. Maybe. No, I doubt it. We... I would definitely need... Five to get the Morpho Knight blade. I do not believe I will be getting the Morpho Knight blade. Though we might see if uh, we can do the final treasure road. Yep, we need five. Damn it. But we're gonna go see if we can gather the last uh, treasure trove trial. 
potentially. But yeah, the... No, it's not here. Evolve this ability to Morpho Knight. We need the Morpho Knight to get it. But I need more Star Stones. There's at least one. There's at least one uh, Star Stone thingy that I can get maybe repeatedly in one of the levels. Maybe. Oh, we can upgrade you. We're going to upgrade you. I don't care. I have, I have all the dosh in the world. And I'll be grinding away to get the final ability thing. But to think, I almost went through the entirety of this game without dying. At least I don't think I died before. They can play even more songs on their new incredible stage. The de <laughs> Deedly Dees gave us a special figure to thank for... <laughs> it's going to be more narcissism. Yep, more narcissism. The Deedly Dees. It's the local 4D band, the Deedly Dees. They love to jam in front of a crowd and start each request off with a wah-wah. Let's go! Band meetings at the cafe can get heated due to their different musical tastes, but when the tune kicks in, they fall in perfectly in sync. Ah, and the waifu is still here. I'm really glad we were able to find Leon, Gar. Oops, I mean Leon, and bring him back. I haven't forgotten, you know. When I used up all my powers to close the connection between worlds, you saved me, Claraline. You kept me alive and made sure I'd be able to see Kirby again. You helped me when I needed it, and we helped you in return. Now we can all be friends together. I would love if the in a sequel... I would love in a sequel if the Beast Pack returned. I would love it. Granted, the, uh, the mouse, the mouse, uh, criminal gang never returned, so the likelihood of the Beast Pack returning for another game is very low. But yeah, I love this game. I've yet to do the Ultimate Arena in which Ultimate Fecto Elphilis lies, but we'll have to do that another time. More grinding to get the stones to evolve the Morpho Knight, abil uh, uh, Morpho Knight Blade, and do the Morpho Knight Challenge uh, treasure trial. But yeah, I love this game. The music is great. The graphics are super nice. The post game is really good. Because while it is just a oh ho ho, you uh, must go through even more and uh, must go through these levels that you kind of did before, but it's kind of a a best of selection that and they do have difference do do have differences new uh attack well, well yeah new attacks from like mid bosses and actual bosses new environmental hazards all the way through new collectible all the way through that you can reliably do in one shot thank you very much game and then an ending barrage that at the very least it wasn't a boss rush because it had checkpoints. A boss rush is, you have to beat all the bosses in one go or else you lose. But no. It went through, it was nice, it was heartwarming, and again, this really feels like a... Like, it felt like a more cohesive story than most Kirby games. Even though, like, Robobot is probably more cohesive at the end of the day. I think Robobot is the more story story of all the stories. If that makes sense. But yeah. Super in super interesting that we got freaking Morpho Knight again. I did not expect that. I did not expect Morpho Knight to come along. Because I, well, at first I thought, oh my god, it's Galactonite. Nope, it was the butterfly one. 
I think the harder one, because I think Galactonite was defeated by Meta Knight and thrown into the abyss. Morpho Knight's still hanging around, apparently. And again, that just goes to show how powerful Morpho Knight is. He came in and hijacked a final boss. <sighs> but yeah. Super hyped to have seen Morpho Knight again. This is just a great game. Bosses were great. I don't think there was a single boss that I hated. Morpho Knight is a bit frustrating, but he's, uh, at the end of the day, manageable, and I just spammed bombs. <laughs> uh. And the sad thing is, if I didn't upgrade my Meta Knight Blade, I would have been able to get the Morpho Knight Blade. I am a failure. Blah. But yeah, super impressive that they threw in a final boss that managed to kill me. But also nice of them to throw in a checkpoint as a, a double deal. But yeah. Just love this game. This game is amazing. I hope that the uh, HAL Laboratories, I hope they continue making more Kirby games like this. At least one more. At least one more. Because maybe the, like, I mean, they went through the trouble of making the engine. Well, maybe they made the engine, but they made like all the building blocks. They made all the building blocks to uh, this uh, Kirby game. So maybe we'll have a. Uh, so maybe this will be the triple deluxe to a Robobot that we'll have later down the line on the Switch. Hopefully, perhaps we'll just have to wait and see. But yeah, this is an amazing game. And again, Elphalin is a wonderful Kirby sidekick. The final boss of the game, Fecto Elphalus. Amazing design and an amazing finale. And then a nice post-game rambunctious romp to seal the deal with the returning Morpho Knight. Utterly brilliant. But yeah, I don't really have much else to say with the looming doom of the frickin' ultimate arena up there. Arena Cup Z. That's going to be horrifying. Ah. Mm, but yes, but yes, I do believe that that will be it. So anyway, thank you very much for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed what you saw. And if you did, perhaps you would like to follow me here on Twitch. For those elsewhere, if you want more from me, you can watch me have edited content on YouTube at Neon Icy Wings. Even though life isn't leaving much time to really dedicate to doing that anymore just yet perhaps in the future meanwhile there's also another youtube channel neon icy games that where i upload vods and recordings and archives of these here streams and if you're one of those people watching one of these uh, here stream archives you can come and watch me play these games live at twitch.tv neon icy wings if you'd like to see my attempts at art you can see me upload those things to uh, twitter Tumblr, Newgrounds, and DeviantArt. All of them at Neon Icy Wings, except for Tumblr, which is Icy Wings Art Corner. But yes, but yes, thank you very much. I do not know what will be next, because I might want to take a break from Kirby, so I might start up a different game, and then maybe one day we will come in and have a single bonus stream in which we try to take on the arena after giving me time to see if I can grind up uh, the star piece of things needed to get the Morpho Knight Blade so we can do the trial treasure thing and uh, then do the Abomination. What game I will play next, I do not know. It is, right now, it is kind of Tales of Fantasia, Persona 4 Golden are kind of rattling along in my brain, but it'll, it'll come to me the next time I decide to stream. Granted, the... Uh, Probably won't be tomorrow. Maybe Friday. I will try to stream Friday and see if there is something. If I can't think of anything, I might do a run-through of Sekiro, because I love Sekiro. Fun game. But yeah, at the end of the day, I'll come up with something by Friday. And uh, think again. Thank you very much for watching. Hope to see you dudes next time. Bye. Bye. Say, say goodbye, Kirby. Kirby says goodbye. Once again, I, I, I like the... 
Well, I guess I could do the outro stream. We had the, aha, Kirby finale thing, so that fits. Yeah. Have a good night, good day, or good morning to wherever you are, and thank you again.